So in this video, we'll understand how to create a branch. Suppose if you are given with any defect, so generally we'll be save as in the respect to rules into new versions and fix it. But the best practice here is to always make your fix done in a branch. And after that, we are supposed to merge that branch to the rule set with its version. So now let us understand how to create a new branch. For that, just open application definition and click on add branch and maybe something like test defect. So insert defect or give some branch name, meaningful branch name. Just click on submit and you have to save this. So a branch will be created. So once the branch got created, you can save as the rules into that branch or you can create the new rules also. So let me create a new rule. Maybe I'm creating some property rule. So make sure it is created in development branch. So if we select it like no branch, then we can see version numbers applicable for this rule set. So if I'm selecting branch here, so there will not be any version numbers applicable. So let me create and open. So we can see one particular rule got created in this branch. So likewise, you have to create all the respect to rules. So let me save it for now. So likewise, you can create all the remaining sections or whatever in the respect to branch. Once the branch is completely or once your defect is completely fixed, you can merge this branch to the existing version, existing rule set version. So how to merge the branch? So that we'll see in the next video. Okay. Thank you. Everyone.